Suspected paramilitary militia members torched 35 buses in Rio de Janeiro after one of their leaders was killed in a police operation, paralyzing parts of the scenic Brazilian city, officials said. The chaotic scenes erupted on Rio's west side after an operation that Rio state governor Claudio Castro said killed the nephew and right-hand man of a militia boss known as Zinho, the group's alleged leader in the region. Rio Mayor Eduardo Pais called the militia members idiots as well as criminals. Militia members on the west side are burning public buses paid for with public money to protest against a police operation, he said. Public Bus Operators Association Rio Onibus said 35 buses had been set on fire, including five used on the special rapid transit lines launched for the Rio Olympics in 2016. Public transport was partly suspended on the city's west side. Police operations against heavily armed criminal gangs are common in Rio, where poor favela neighborhoods are often caught in the crossfire. Militia members are often former police officers. They initially formed neighborhood watch groups to protect residents from drug gangs in the city, which is known for its picturesque beaches but also its violent crime. The militias however soon evolved into organized crime groups themselves, controlling sectors including internet service, cable TV, transportation and construction. The latest violence comes after three doctors visiting Rio for a conference were gunned down at a beachside bar in an upscale neighborhood three weeks ago.